Hi you guys, it's Lindsay here. I wanted to do a pattern review for you on this adorable pattern from Simplicity. It's a Project Runway inspired pattern, um, Simplicity 1651. I chose the bodice front B and the bodice back C. And you can see it has this little twist detail on the front, which is so cute. Okay, so here are some close-up shots of the dress itself. You can get a better idea of that twist detail in the front. It has a waist seam and some pleating in the skirt. The hem falls right at the knee. Here it is from the side. There is a side zipper um, that you can barely see there, um, and you can get an idea of some more of the pleating. Here is the back bodice. It's pretty plain. It does have two back darts and it's cut on the fold. There's no center back seam there. And I don't know if you can tell, but those are little bows that are printed on this chambray, chambray fabric, which is so cute. I thought that the bows tied in really well with the twist in the front. It almost kind of, you know, mimics the idea of uh, the little pinch in the center of a bow. So here is a close-up of that really great twisted detail. I love the little peekaboo that's there. It was easier to do than I thought it was going to be, but I will say the illustrations aren't totally easy to understand at first. So I would recommend this pattern for an intermediate sewist or at least someone who is sewn with commercial patterns several times. I also wanted to show you what it looks like on the inside so you could see what was a facing and what was lined. The little cutout is faced. The entire twist though is completely lined. The shoulder seams are finished with your serger and the back neckline is finished with a facing. So kind of a combination there. You can see the back darts there and the waist seam is finished with your serger and the hem is turned under a quarter of an inch and then turned under again. I really do think this is an adorable pattern, unlike anything else that I have in my wardrobe. I would recommend making a muslin. There are a lot of intricate pieces in that bodice that come together in an interesting way, so you want to make sure you can get the fit on those just right. But other than that, I think it's a great pattern and I really love it.